say, let it be known. I'm working hard when I ain't on the phone. This ain't a hunt, this ain't a phone. What's up, y'all? It's Elena, and I'm going to be reacting to Community Season 1, Episode 3. Last episode, we were in Spanish class, and we seen the Spanish teacher for the first time, and um, he is hilarious. He's probably my favorite after Abed, but we'll see. We'll see. Right now, he might be up there. Everyone had to partner up for their Spanish lesson. And at the end, Pierce and Joel. Wait, his name isn't Joel. What's his name? I keep forgetting his name. I know it's not Joel. They had to do a Spanish conversation, you know, and they turned it into a damn Broadway show slash parade slash festival slash robot fight. It was just a mess, okay? And they both got F's for that. Y'all did not do the assignment at all. This was not the assignment. <laughs> I don't know what they thought they was doing. I don't know what Pierce thought it was doing because it was his idea. The last episode, I actually felt sad for Pierce. I have a feeling that I'm not going to anymore in the future. I really feel like he's going to piss me off. Or like he's gonna do something wild and crazy again. But um we'll see. But yeah, if y'all wanna see the full reactions, it will be on Patreon. The link is in the description below. Let's get into it. Okay, this don't look like Spanish class. What's this the Spanish class? My name's Jeff. I was really hoping to see the Spanish teacher, y'all. Would you like to cook? a thing that makes men weep okay. yet a third of life is spent this must be english class sleep. or something open your textbooks to page 37 now close them and throw them away well he's one of those he's one of those professors like bitch i paid too much money for this You made me buy this book, and we don't even need it. <laughs> you got me fucked up. We better be using that damn book. Take off your shoes. Quick, take off your shoes. Everyone, take your shoes off. Okay, this is the point where I have to walk out, because this is foolishness. Get up and walk out the door. This day could be your last. You could die in your sleep. You could get hit by a bus. You, that mole is raised and dark. It's not a good combo. You are an voice command. Voice command. Voice command. <laughs> He's so Voice old command. and out of touch. Voice command. <clears throat> Voice command. Would you please use the buttons? Okay, Grandpa. <laughs> oh, God bless you. The hell was that? <laughs> Who is that? Guys, Professor Whitman. He thinks he's in Dead Poet Society. There's no tests, there's no work, it's just day season. The deadline to enroll is tomorrow. I suggest you all do it. Well, some of us are here to actually learn things. I'm in. Me too. It sounds educational. Oh, so she likes him. Dude, okay. I love Robin Williams. Abed, not a fan. In every movie, there's an authority figure that gets mad at him for making people laugh. No, are, are you going to pay for classes? Oh, can't. My dad will only pay for classes. Did he say he wasn't a fan of Robin Williams or his movie? 2001, 9/11 was pretty much 9/11 of the falafel business. Either or. Your dad has your You're crazy. Life planned out for you? Are you even interested in falafel? I'm interested in making movies, but my dad says all media is Western propaganda that negatively stereotypes Arabs. And he should see Aladdin. Jafar was a fat ass. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he was. Abed, mm. how much does a film class cost? Seventy dollars. That's it. Britta. Jeff. Britta. Isn't Abed's dad a hardcore Muslim? You're not as understanding as Christians. You can get your hair cut off with a salami sword. Surely. <laughs> what? That's the racist thing I've ever heard. <laughs> hey, Troy sneezes like a girl. And how about I pound you like a boy? That didn't come out right. Don't you all just leave him alone with his cute little baby stuff? Huh? You're not my mother. She's not? <laughs> okay, this is just... What is going on? <laughs> Shirley Bailey. Shirley, you get an A. Hey. If you can tell Damn. Me one, oh, it's has to. Where I go. Okay, let's go. Never again. Shirley? To get a degree in business so I can sell my baked goods and whatnot on the internet. Why? Are you here? To get a degree in business so I can sell my baked goods and whatnot on the internet. Why are you here? 
because I wasted 15 years of my life on a man who left me with nothing but stretch marks and a foggy memory of two bland orgasms, and now it's time to get what's mine. Damn. Day teased. <laughs> Only when we stopped stopping our life. Why did the pretty young girl die alone, surrounded by sweater-wearing cats who are trained to use <laughs> human toilets? <laughs> get up on your desk. That's so gross. Come on. Stand on your desk. No oh, animal yes. should be on a toilet that you use. She made it! <laughs> Everyone, stand on your desks. Up, 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 come on. Rise, rise, rise above the programming. All your lives you were told, don't stand on your What desk. class is this again? <gasps> okay, mommy. Oh, it's okay. Go to the nurse. Seize the day. You know I was about to fill you. She away. fell hard as fuck. Tell ten people that you love them. Go to hell. Listen, I, I have never lived until I met you. I I love you. Oh, there's one down, nine to go. Not that I need the gray, or even want it. Well, I'm glad to hear it. Because if you don't genuinely seize the day before the end of the week, then you will be seizing an F for the semester. This is no way to teach accounting. Oh, this is an accounting class. In advance, how to prove Actually, I'm doing a movie about my dad. That is brilliant. How did that is a bad him? idea, I think. Part hasn't happened yet. Here he comes. Hey! You want to get involved in my family's business? Holy war. Where <laughs> do I find Mr. Bitter? I'm Mr. Bitter. That's right. I'm a woman with rights, and you can see my whole face. Oh, I get it because I'm Adam. I must hate women. Let me tell you something. I love women. But I'm getting a major B-word vibe from you. Wow, I can't believe I missed out on getting involved in this. You go host American Idol and you stop messing <laughs> with my son. He's a special boy. I raise him, okay? You don't raise him. Raising him means letting him follow his dreams. <laughs> He's just sleeping. You don't know recorded it. <laughs> Tuck polio. You lost me. Abed wants to study film. I don't want to the house. Wait, what does he say? He says we're leaving. Death between us. Y'all are in Y'all are in public. Your faith and your family's private. What what is this? What is what is, what is that? Citizen. You going to whip your ass if you wanted to. And he has the right to stay. I had a father like you. And the day I finally cut myself loose is the day I finally started being happy. Well, that went well. Ooh. Make some adjustments to my film. Jeff, I think you should play the role of my father. I don't want to be your father. It's perfect. You already know your lines. <laughs> that is sad. That is terrible. Don't tell your children that shit. I mean, Alana, stop cursing, please. He's rapist. Professor Whitman comes by here every morning, and I need him to What's see up with the tie? celebrating life. Well, that, a lot of people talk a good game, but you, you follow through. Love you. Thank you. But that doesn't happen to you a lot. Happened yesterday. Shirley just doing her homework. Hillary, thank you for getting people coffee. I love you. Oh, because he said tell ten people that. Oh, okay. I will get a small black coffee. Boo! An ordinary <laughs> coffee for an ordinary life. Good Coffee is disgusting. Morning, I don't know how y'all drink that shit. Sorry, Mr. Winger. And then there I go saying it again. Shut I just can't stop cursing y'all. I'm sorry. A birthday cake. <laughs> <laughs> I see men in your situation, Chloe. <laughs> what? No, those are both of you. You were on top of the world before, and now no one gives a rat's ass. I can help you with your image. First, you need some jacket to look like a high school bitch. But more, <laughs> more importantly, it's your sleeves. When I was a CEO, I had a, an array of masculine standards, assertive dominance. You know about the explosive. Let me hear it. <laughs> silence, sneeze, the. <laughs> or the draw them in, sneeze, no. Maybe I wouldn't sneeze because I'm in control. 
And you could even use a sneeze to drive home a point. Like, I think I, I think the Cubs are going to win all this year. <laughs> Please. Tell me more. He's really gonna listen to this man? Y'all full of I know why I can't stand y'all sometimes. <laughs> do not sneak. What's going on with him? But yeah, do not sneeze in front of me like that. Please don't do that. He knows this is just a facade. Oh, so please. Really fun. Sloppy. And considering the age of these girls, unwittingly creepy. Damn it. Do it for yourself. Or you won't just fail my class. You'll fail life. He low-key preaching. Oh, please. He low-key preaching, but he doing too much. Abed is not normal. <laughs> That's what you bought when you intentionally tangled yourself in his life. He's not, though. He's not normal. Look, will you just... What in the hell? Is he gonna kill us? <laughs> At this point, I don't know. Thanks for the pizza, Abed. Oh, that look I'm good. Starving. It look kind of dry, yeah, it's though. It's nice, like a, like a picnic. It's for class. I believe it's more important. The la la. Someone order seven lots. Hey, my I boy. No, you don't got it. I got it, Abed. I got everything. What is wrong with you? All I want to do is take care of you. I know you're not stupid. Are you doing this on purpose? You don't know how to eat a pizza? Why won't you answer me? Because this doesn't mean anything. You better believe it. Right up. What do you think, Dad? I think you are really weird, Abed. And I think the wrong person just left. Perfect. That's a wrap. That guy was your dad? <laughs> Is that your fake? Let me give you mine. You and your fellow left the girlfriend got all up in my stuff because you wanted to be covered and be I'm finished. Finished. All right, let's Just give us that. a little watch. Let's watch this mug. Is it from my buddy? I don't want to be your father. I think you are weird, Abed. Okay, look, I need to talk to you about Abed. He's not normal. Oh, this is kind of sad. What is wrong with you? All I want to do is take care of you. Why will you not answer me? What do you think, Dad? I think you are weird, Abed. And I think the wrong person just left. Citizen Kane. Bruh. I'm trying to be sad, Abed. Aww. Damn. 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 Then I pay for the class. Good. Great. I love this. I love this episode. I love this ending. This falafel is a fallback. Abe. It isn't called friend business. It's called show business. He's smoking. Honey, let him leave the nest. Get your hand off. <laughs> I was gonna say thigh, but she, we was thinking the same thing. Me and her like, we like this. <laughs> what the 
The way I would have punched him, because I would have been so afraid. <laughs> Why is he Carmen? Someone get that man admitted. He is not okay. I'm not comfortable with him out here in society. Am I crumping? No. <laughs> Am I crumping? No. Am I crumping? No. Am I crumping now? No. This is crumping. Show him how it's done. <laughs> Show has done. Okay, none of y'all can curl. <laughs> Alright, y'all, that was Community Season 1, Episode 3. This episode was so good. I love the ending. Um, It made me sad to see Abed's movie and to see how his parents treated him. Because we all know that, you know, Abed is not, he's not like the normal people i feel i feel bad saying that like, how do i explain this without he's not like everyone else like i'm just say that he feels well his dad low-key blamed him for the mom and everything because that really happens that really happens in real life you know that really happens in real life like the parents they have a special needs child or something and sometimes one of them can't take it anymore and just they just leave because they can't really be they don't like looking at their child as something different. I mean, as someone different, you know. But yeah, I'm glad that his dad came to the conclusion to let him stay in film class so he can express himself the way he should be doing. Like, hopefully Abed and his dad can really, like, mend that relationship and grow and do better. I really see that happening one day. Jeff finally got to kiss Greta. It wasn't genuine, I don't think, but it might be. Because I think Greta does like him. But I'm glad they finally, you know, got to do what they wanted to do, in my opinion. I thought like they both wanted to kiss each other, and they finally did it. And he got an A-plus for it. So, hey, it's a win-win situation. But, yeah, yeah, I really enjoyed this episode. Oh, wait. And, um, I'm going to need Pierce to get together. Because why are you teaching this man to sneeze like, a, like an animal, like a lunatic? That is not okay. Do not sneeze like that around me. I prefer the little baby sneeze that he was doing. <laughs> But yeah, y'all, I really enjoyed this episode. Full reactions on Patreon. The link is in the description below. Thank y'all for watching, and I'll catch y'all in the next one. Bye. Hey, hey, okay, let it be known. I'm working hard when I ain't on the phone. This ain't a hunt, this ain't a phone. Grind never stopping, I'm keeping it cold. Unlocking the door with the heart.